guys, it's Sherry with Cards and More by Sherry and the Supply Garden. Just wanted to do a quick little haul video for you today. I went over to Hobby Lobby the other day and I went just to get these um, to put my homemade shimmer mist in that I've made. Um, my friend uh, Julie over at Jay's Crafty Studio had recommended that I get these from Hobby Lobby. They are $2.49 a piece. They tend to not clog up as much because they have this nice, I don't know if you can see that, it's kind of a filtered end. Because I was using one of these guys, you know, that you get like where all the travel stuff is at Walmart, and it just wasn't working. And then I also recycled a, a shimmer spritz bottle, and it works sometimes. Uh, but I went ahead and went over and picked up. Well, actually, I got two of them. They're a really nice size. I don't know how many ounces. I would say they hold probably, I don't know, maybe eight ounces. But they're they're a very nice size. So we'll see how they work. So I got two of those, two forty nine. Pretty much everything I got was on sale, or I used a coupon. Uh, my coupon I used on this matte medium. My friends over at the Crafters Community on Google Plus uh, have kind of inspired me to start getting outside my comfort zone and try some new things. So I'm going to try this uh, matte medium. I don't know on what, but I'm going to try it. So that was 40% off with coupon. I did not have a coupon for these. I just got a little set of acrylic tube paints. These were only $3.99. Um, you know, you stand there and you look at all those colors and you think, man, I want this, I want that. But this has all the primary colors plus a nice um, sap green and black and white in it. So I thought this might be a nice thing to start out with. Um, I'm sure this isn't a very good brand, but just for starting out and playing and learning, this should be fine. I also got my first venture into the world of distress inks. Tim Holtz products were 30% off. So I picked up Vintage Photo and the applicator. So we're going to try that. Since I, I distress edges on almost everything that I stamp and make, I thought I would try this and see how I like the way the ink works. Those were 30% off. Then what else did I get? Oh, I'm getting ready to do a couple of um, some craft shows in October, November, December. I have a big vinyl banner that I got from Vistaprint for my table, but it's very heavy and it's hard to attach um, and, and it wants to stay curled all the time. So I thought, okay, I'm going to abandon my banner and I got these. They're on the wire so you can shape them and do whatever you want with them. They were regularly $1.99, but all of this stuff was 40% off. Yeah, 40% off the Christmas decor. So I got these nice sleeve ones for the October and November show. And then for the December show, I got two of these that are iridescent snowflakes. Aren't those pretty? And then two of these gorgeous little turquoise stars. And I'll just mix those together on the surface of my table and kind of drape them over the top too. So maybe that'll look pretty. I'm thinking about trying to make some banners with my silhouette, but I haven't got that brave yet. Uh, all right, then I also got, they had their floral apartment. Their ribbon was 50% off. When I was doing my ornaments the other day and tying ribbon on the top of them, I discovered I didn't have very much or hardly any silver ribbon. So I picked up a real thin silver and a kind of an organza. I'm hoping that's what it is with a shimmer to it. Then just an ivory satin and a gold one like that little tiny silver one and a white organza that's got a, a woven edge I think you can see that on the camera so those were all 50% off and they were only I mean think the most expensive one was $2.99 so that was a good deal um, then the next thing I picked up I also discovered recently I don't have very much Christmas pattern paper so they had this pattern paper and the bigger stacks also over with what they call Christmas crafts and all of that was 40% off. Normally I would buy 12 by 12 stacks but I'm trying to think smaller and trying not to get so much so I just picked up two. These are 6 by 6 pads. 
and they're all single-sided yes they all are single-sided so I picked up one that has white accents and then I picked up one that was more vintagey looking with um, ivory colored accents so no matter what base cardstock I'm using um, these are gonna work and these have some really pretty it's nice weight have some really pretty designs in it little old-fashioned vintage Santa Claus bells oh that's really pretty you could even cut those apart and use those as little accents and I have signed up for a Christmas themed junk journal swap over on the junk journals page um, I'll link that in the comments by the way so I figured I better go ahead and get some Christmas paper there's some more that could be cut apart and used for uh, tags or bookmarks all kinds of different things very pretty I really like that this one's brighter more you know traditional looking those patterns are really gonna screw with the camera <laughs> but these will be nice with more traditional looking you know you think of bright red and green Christmassy kind of stuff these these will be, well they hurt my eyes I can't imagine what they're doing to the camera so these will be nice these were regularly $6.99 and like I said all of this was 40% off um, these each have 48 sheets in them so I should be able to make those go for a little ways so that's just a little haul that I did um, at Hobby Lobby uh, I will link in that crafters community for you so if you're interested in checking us out over there and I will also link in um, my friend Julie's YouTube channel she has lots of great videos she's the one where I learned how to make my own uh, shimmer mist here so I'm hoping and I've used it I have used it even though I didn't have a nice new sprayer uh, and it's really really pretty this is made by the way with this um, eyeshadow that you can get at the Dollar Tree and they have it in lots of different colors this is I think called yeah Snow White works great for just an all-purpose shimmer Okay, well that's everything that I got. If you have any questions about anything I bought or if you want to chime in and tell me good ways to use this stuff since I've never used it before, <laughs> I would sure appreciate it. Like and subscribe and I'll see you the next time.